Some pretty epic show dances there. And now talking of iconic routines, I think it's a good time to welcome Strictly's very own Argentine tango choreographers, Leandro and Maria. Yes! It is so exciting to have you on the show. We've been talking about getting you on the show for a while, and finally, here we are. You have had some amazing routines in all the series that you've been with us as choreographers. But first, I want to ask you both, for the people that don't know, how did the two of you get into Argentine tango? How did it happen? Well, I was born in Argentina. Ah, and over it's there, in your blood. It's, it's, it's the thing, it's everywhere, everywhere. Yeah. it's in the air. So I started picking it up as a, as a hobby, really. It's the thing that you do. Yeah. Uh, and then I started studying a little bit more, I got more into it. And by the time I was 18, I was traveling the world, touring oh. as, a, as a pro dancer, yes. As a pro dancer at 18, and what about yourself, Maria? Well, I started very young with gymnastics and then with ballet. And then through my teens, I did some ballroom lessons. And then, of course, I was a fan of Strictly all of my life. Really? And I saw That's a beautiful amazing. Argentine tango that I fell in love. And then I said, okay, I'm going to leave the ballroom and all the other dances and dedicate myself to, to the Argentine tango. Oh, it is such a beautiful <laughs> dance. I think a lot of people would say it's probably one of their favorites to yes. watch on the show. Yeah, yeah. Um, now, it's not one of the 10 dances that the professionals are trained in for the show. So you choreograph the Argentine tangos a lot for the couples. Do you yeah. have to cater the dances to each individual couple's strengths and weaknesses? Absolutely, absolutely. So mm -hmm. every choreography is made for the couples. Yeah. So we follow their journey, we study their weaknesses, their yeah. strengths, and we put together a choreography that fits and hopefully highlights their strengths. Yes. And then throughout the week, Maria, once it is choreographed, do you work with them a lot throughout the week as well? Yes, we try to maximize every single second that we can yeah. throughout the week. We get super, super involved. Um, but not only do we work with them to share the, the choreography, but we also try to kind of give them glimpses of the history of the culture so they really capture the essence of the Argentine tango. Yeah. So when they go to perform, they're in the they're vibe. Like in the right yes. zone. Yes. Right. Yeah, yeah. Leandro, what is the secret to a great Argentine tango? Do you want to know the secret? Please tell me the secret. <laughs> do you want the secret? Uh, it's not smashing it's about plate. <laughs> go the, on. It's about the connection, the connection oh. with the couple. Yes, it's all about what happens. Everybody should stop breathing for the three minutes or whatever the, the song is last. It's, it's all about the couple being together and maintaining that connection throughout the dance. Because uh, you, you do, when you watch the Argentine tangos, it's like it's just the two of them in that yes. moment. You really yes. feel it when you watch. Yes. Um, we've had some incredible Argentine tangos this series, uh, but after spending some time in the training room with them throughout the week, like here we see Florian Vito's Argentine yes. tango, how does it feel to see the routine come to life on Saturday night for the two of you? You know, it's strictly very special because you start with a concept you start putting the steps, the choreography together, but then on Saturday night, costumes, uh -huh. lights, the music, the live music, the choreography, everything gels together and it creates, and it creates like, it's magic. It's magic. 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 Yes. But that we definitely feel emotional. I have to say that every, every time after every dance or throughout the dance, I have a little cry <laughs> in the back. <laughs> and then regardless of the, the scores, I think we both get quite emotional because we have put so much not only us, but we know the journey throughout the days. Mm. And they have very limited time to learn and capture the essence. So we know how much effort they put. So we get like, it's our little babies. <laughs> yeah, it's your little baby routine, isn't it? Yeah. Um, you choreographed one of the professional group numbers this year with yeah. Jason Gilkison as well. And it was a beautiful routine, by the way. I love that, that group number. But we had Karen and Luba as yes. the leads in that dance, which is yes. two women doing an Argentine tango yes. together. So what did you have to take in consideration when it was two women dancing the Argentine tango? Actually, you know what? It, it was funny because we started having different alternatives because uh -huh. we didn't know how, how it's going to be. Uh, but they did absolutely fantastic. They got very, very involved. Yes. Uh, so actually, we didn't take out. We started adding more stuff for nice. them. Nice. Excellent. Because they, they were, were excellent. so, so good. They got like, give really... us more. No, we'll do the list. <laughs> yes. I was like, are you sure? No, we'll do everything. They did every single thing. They were perfect. Yeah. yeah. yeah and yeah. they have such an amazing bond, those yes. two. So they were really yes. connected. You showed. felt it. Yeah. Uh, well, thank you so much for coming to talk to us. Thank We've you. absolutely loved having you. you. And thank this, you. I cannot wait because later on, you are going to be doing a very special performance at the end for us as well. Can't wait to see that. Yeah. Give it up for Leandro and Maria. Yeah. <laughs> Dancing us out of the show with an Argentine tango, it's the incredible Leandro and Maria.